Hello and welcome into the Piles of Paragraphs creative space. I'm Lori and today we're going to work on the Roxy Creations Week 17 challenge. Um, let's see, what did Rach call it? Scrapbook papers pockets with built-in tabs or something similar to that. Please go over to um, Rachel's uh, YouTube channel, Roxy Creations, and uh, see what she uh, what she came up with and uh, probably the proper name because I'm not sure I got that right. Well I've got quite a few scraps of scrapbook paper and light card stock and so we'll get going on this. Let's see where's my ruler. Slip over there. Okay. I'm not sure what size journal that I'm making this for but I think it probably will be on the smaller size because I'm gonna make an attempt at a a journal for another one of my great nieces. Um, she's graduating from high school so let's see. You know, maybe maybe we need both the big ruler and the small ruler. My uh, mat has markings on it but I never seem to quite figure figure them out. So let's see this is not quite eight that way. Let's see. And this is oh, the full 12 this way. So let's go. Hmm. Be about four inches deep here. And then small one. Make the pocket like that. Then we'll fold this over to be help with the tab and the uh, okay. I just have my bone folder. Oh. <laughs> I put it in my I put it in my scrap spin. That's not a that's not a good place for it. Okay, so we'll start with that one. Oh goodness, not prepared. I didn't get my my hole punch out. Let's get, let's get that out so that I remember what I was thinking when I made this one. And I'll do a little divot there, sort of in the center. Oops. I did both sides well. There you go. Since I did that, let's go ahead and make that look like it was intentional. <laughs> Bits fly all over. Okay, so here's the first one. Let's see. This is really kind of fun paper. It's not... Leader edge is not. Um, let's see. How do I want to do this one? We'll do. I want to do this one about three and a half. And I'll trim the. There. So, this one will want this side to be the pocket, so we'll go this way. Ooh, I should have scored this, I guess. Okay. <clears throat> and we'll remember to uh, pull the tab up before I. There's another piece. Okay, let's look for something quite a bit different. This one's different. I might weight paper, so let's see. Hi, Dev. Oh, Dev Cat's here under my feet. Let's trim 
this time. Hi, Dev. Hi, Dev. No, no, but no, no, bear. No, Dev. No, Dev. Dev doesn't need to do a walkthrough today. Okay, get down, Dev. Okay. Okay, baby. Scoochy, scooch. Scoochy, scooch. Come on. <laughs> okay, sweetie. Okay, my sweetie. Okay. Okay. How about you get down, Debbie? Let's do four and a half on this one. Since this is such lightweight paper. Okay, Dev. Let's get down, baby, son. Get down. Don't, don't need the pencil. Okay. Down, Debbie. Get down, Dev. Dev, Dev. Get down, Dev. Dev. Let's see. Oh, good. There's my school board. Ooh. Well, let me trim the edge off because apparently. Trim that not well before. Okay. A little tattered edge off there. Okay, Dev. Don't, no, 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 no. Honey, no, no. You don't need to chew on that. Okay. It's okay, Debbie. It's okay, Debbie. It's okay, Devin. It's okay, Dev. Hey, sweetheart. Is your brother in your spot in the window and you want to be there? Okay. Why don't you go why don't you go look out the other window? Why don't you go look out the the other window? There you go. Good girl, Debbie. Good girl, my sweet Devin. Okay. Run a little bit of glue. Use my art glitter glue. Put the pin in the bathtub. <laughs> well, I hope everyone is having a good day and had a chance to do something fun and crafty today. Let's see. Let's hold this one this way. Okay. Those three. Let's see. What else do we have? It's different. journal will probably have a, have a fair bit of color in it. Well, I think I'm kind of making all mine the same. Let's see. Oops, 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 oops. Uh, sorry, I dropped my, my scoring tool. On the floor. Okay, get that. This. I don't think this really has a right, an upside down or upside down or right side up. There we go. Ooh, golly. Let's see. <laughs> I'm telling you. My second video of the day and, uh, I'm still kind of not doing all that great. Hmm. That's what happens when I don't do videos for several days. Okay, so, well, I could do this part over and over and over again, but I think you get the, the general idea, and these will go on a page with this this is a teeny tiny page, so it's a bad, uh, a bad example, but you get the idea. We'll, we'll pretend it's bigger. Um, so go on here, and then um, we'll stick off enough on the side to actually make a tab coming out of the journal. So let's see about decorating these that we got going. Let's see, we've got two green ones. I really like this one, so I don't think I'll do a whole, whole lot. On that one, so let's get started with that. 
a little bit of um, book page. Put my cutter on the floor so I don't knock it over and create a very loud <clears throat> clanging sound. Oh, my voice. I still I haven't decided if it's a cold that I've got or if it's just my allergy. So I apologize for sounding kind of uh, <clears throat> not my best. much convinced that my husband has a cold, although he's still in the denial phase that he goes to every time he gets sick. Oh, I don't feel sick. <clears throat> yeah, well, any hoozle. I'm uh, pretty sure that he caught a cold on his trip. Excuse me, let me get a quick sip of coffee. Mm, sorry, sorry. My goodness. Okay. Have this here. I have some rather shiny pieces. Let's go move the and move my my scrap back. Let's get a little bit closer. Flowers. Got it here. It's a little big. Let's see what do I have in here. Dragon. You can tell I've been. Uh, Kind of sorting through my bits because I've got some really old scrapbook paper and some really old um, pieces from my my stash. Oops, sorry about that. There went one of my glue sticks onto the. I don't think it did quite make the floor. Oh. My work table has a. Let's see, what would you call it? It's not really a little shelf. It's a little. Mm, I don't know. Runs between the legs and yeah, I guess it is a shelf because I have stuff I have stuff stacked on it. Um, and it um, I think it I think it managed to catch my oops my uh, glue stick before it got near the floor. Okay, it's, dragonfly is on some vellum, so we'll see how, how that does. Oh, I cannot keep track of my phone folder this morning. Okay, we're, <coughs> okay, well, we'll just, we'll just use this, because I'm sure it's right in front of me, and you guys can all see it, but I can't see it. Hmm. I do hope it wasn't my bone folder that fell. Oh, well, moving on. Moving on, moving on, moving on. That's weird. Hmm. Well, there it is. Okay. And this is, um, I think the, these were washi tape designs, and I, I, I'm not sure whose they were. I don't know if they're Rachel's, or I tend to always think my stuff is from Rachel, because that's what I I use most often, but I don't know for sure. Like I said, this has been in my stash for a while. So there you go. Oh, I am bound and determined to glue that pocket. Yeah. So we got that, got that there. Oh, that's going to be an interesting tab. I'll have to put something else there. <laughs> Want to put another piece of oh. When we put it in the journal, we'll put something else on it. But for now, we're gonna, I'm going to call that one done. Put it in the in the done bowl. Okay. We have this one. It looks like old wallpaper to me. I just love this paper. Excuse me. One more drink. But it's 
It is paper I have had in my stash for a very, very long time. Let's see. Oh, goodness. I ate my breakfast and my stomach is still growling. Let's see. Give me a little bit of... is quite musical. She's a beautiful, a beautiful voice. But actually, I think all the girls do. The girls, being my uh, my sister's granddaughters. Of course, coming from the aunt that uh, can't carry a tune in a bucket is, uh, you know. I appreciate uh, those who have the ability to sing and sing well. Let's see. Do we want a little bit of this here too? Too much the same color. This digital. Let's see. Writing's going all different directions, so we're just going to go with that. And then let's see, what do I have here? I have some stickers from my pal Vernie at Triple, Triple V Vintage. Triple V Vintage on Etsy. Hi, Vernie, if you're watching. pockets shut. Okay. I tried to think of a way to uh, make these into a happy mail um, situation, but I was not successful. But I've got several journals rolling around in my brain that I'm planning to make, so... There will be need for pockets. You know, I have super, super sticky fingers. Let me wipe my fingers off really quickly. Okay. There's the pin. Get the pin out, and hopefully... Not hopefully, we will. We're going to have tremendous success getting this sticker off of here. Onto the pocket. <laughs> she says, hoping to boost her confidence and her ability at sticker peeling. Let's see. Oh, goodness. Uh, well, I think this is a sticker. Maybe it's not. Stickers. Oh, thing does not say. Oh, I think they're stickers. I think I just can't get them loose. Let's see. Try with the pin. Aha, yes. Indeed, indeed, a sticker. Scratch it on the wrong side. Let's do the, the backing side with the pin. <laughs> okay, nope. No, no, no. Okay, well, goodness, we're not going to do very many of these pockets, so... Oh, sometimes I'm too stubborn for my own good. I don't want to give up. Ah, yes. Yay. Ah, 
excess. There we go. Yeah, that's good. I'll probably use something over here too, but perhaps for later. Okay, let's get moving on. <clears throat> oh, excuse me. I'll tell ya. What do I want to put on this one? I have these stamps that are a good color for this. I do, but I can't get them out of their little out of their little bin. Let's go with those three. Well, it's a wonderful spring-like day here, <laughs> or summer light, as uh, <clears throat> I often refer to it. Um, I've had a really nice, um, look like past three days, four days, um, cooled off quite a bit, like, like almost 20 degrees from the beginning of last week to the end, and. Um, <clears throat> but it's going to heat up. It'll be upper 90s here all this week. Um, mid to upper 90s anyway. So, yes. Summer, summer approacheth. I've glued my stamp to my some um, graphic 45 die cuts that I had for a while. Not a huge, huge while, but a while. Let's see. Let's do these. And a leaf. on there. 
think I think we'll just go with these. Okay. Get the art glitter glue out. The pin in the bathtub. I don't say pin in the bathtub for your benefit, really. It's for mine, so I don't lose pin. I never did find that pin that I lost. Someday, I will pick something up and there it will be, I'm sure. Okay. Put that there. I don't know if I could have darker green or a lighter green. I think I like the lighter green. So. I'm quiet again. Sorry about that. Oh, let's see. After my last video, I went downstairs real quick to put a roast in the crock pot, so hopefully that'll turn out well. I have not done that in a really, really long time. That there, the other big leaf here. There we go. Gotta give it the suggestion that there might be a stem there somewhere. So I got that done. Hard boiled egg for my breakfast. Back up to work on my video since I'm behind. Oh, there we go. Oh, I kind of like that one. That one has a bit of a nice feel to it. Okay, one last one and then I will let you go. Let's see, what do I want to put on this one? Oh, I would love to use more of my stickers, but you have to say I'm afraid now. <laughs> I'm a little afraid. What else do we have? I still have a little. Oh, let's just use all these bits that are here. Let's see. Let's put this one down first. And after I get this video done, I think I'm gonna go down and check on my rust dyed fabric that I have in the garage. See if I need to move it back outside. Put it outside for a while yesterday to help it to uh, get completely or more completely dry. I will tell you, I would like to wait until the bundles are completely dry before I unwrap them, but I know myself too well and I will be too anxious to see what has happened this time with that. This is the, the batch that I've done with the, uh, I made up a big, you know, a big bowl, because I did it in a bowl of uh, green tea. And uh, then I soaked the fabric in it for quite a while. And it didn't change the color of the fabric, hardly at all. And, uh, but when I put it in the vinegar and added the um the blue added the let's see the vinegar and the rusty bits then um oh, that was really cool um if you watched my my marguerite miller video i was talking about it so this will all be just a repeat um it turned this cool kind of almost a navy blue color and uh, I have no idea what it will look like when I do the rinse and put it in the salt water. I'm sure most of that will go away, but let's see. I don't know why I think I want four. 
stamps on this one, but for some reason, well, maybe I just don't want that one. Maybe, maybe that's the answer. There we go. Because they're all along the pink shade. Let's see. Let's put the lid back on my little uh, ice cube tray that uh, has a lidded ice cube tray that holds my stamps. It really makes it nice to sort into. Let's see. Which one do I want? Let's put the crowns at the top. So I'm anxious to go out and check on the the rust dyed fabric and see how close it is to me being able to unwrap everything and finish the process. have a, yeah I do, a little bit of the hinge. This was obviously in someone's stamp collection book before it went into the bag of stamps that I bought from the museum in Tucson. Let's see. Him down there. Him down there, I guess. I don't know. There's a little there's a little picture of a human person on there. Oh, those sticky fingers. Sticky fingers, sticky fingers. Okay. So that's the fourth one. Okay, put that in the basket where it goes. Put your lid on there. Oh dear, I didn't put the lid back in the the lid. The pin back in the art glitter glue. That will give me fits later, most likely. Okay. All right. Let's clear all of the debris away here and see what um, what we've created. We have this one, and then this this edge will be the tab. I may come back with my punch. Where's my punch? Oh, well, that's for later, I think. It was sitting right there, but I did it. Well, I did a bit of rearranging the other day, and I know I moved it. I just don't remember to where. Anyway, so I may go ahead and do a fancy punch along that edge, and then this will be a pocket, and this will be the tab off the edge of the page. And this one, um, I may decorate that one since this is such stiff paper. I don't think I want to try to fancy punch it. So there's that one. Here's this one that I did kind of inadvertently fancy punch corner punch really and then here's the first one that we started with our dragonfly and our pretty pink flowers so here we go this is Roxy's weekly challenge for week 17 gosh I just can't even believe that April's already over so anyway there we go so thank you for joining me today and I hope you will join me again in the future and so for now I'll say bye bye <laughs>